Here is another question from one of our viewers. They wanted to know if there was an easy way to lay out a winder stairway because they were having a difficult time trying to figure out how to lay out the 30 degree angle lines. And even though this isn't the method that I use, it's going to be the one that I start using. So here is what you're basically going to be doing. And that will be to lay out a square box on the ground, on the floor, that's going to represent your stairway. Or at least a section of the stairway that you'll be able to use to lay out your winders. Then we're going to measure in two feet in each direction from the center point. And then create a line that is 90 degree angles or square off of each one of these lines. And then you're simply going to measure over one foot, one and seven eighths inches. And this line right here really isn't that important. And it might even be easier for you to make a two foot square box to make sure that these lines are parallel to the other lines that you're using. So this line right here will be parallel to this one. This one here will be parallel to this one. And then you can go ahead and make your marks. And since we're starting from the center point here, this should work for every single winder stairway. And unless the measurements are wrong in my modeling program, which by the way, they rarely are. Maybe it might be off a 32nd of an inch, but that's normally not the case. And to create these lines, all you need to do is line up a straight edge with the center pivot point and your lines here to create a nice 30 degree angle. And for those of you wondering why we're using 30 degrees, that's because we're starting with a 90 degree angle here and simply dividing that into three different sections. Now, another thing you need to check is to make sure that these measurements here are the same on both sides. If they aren't, then recheck the other measurements to see if you made a mistake somewhere. Now, keep in mind, these measurements here should work on all winder stairways with a 30 degree angle, but these measurements here will probably be different. So this measurement here, of course, would work for a three foot, eight inch wide stairway. Now, even though I provided you with a way to create a 30 degree angle, if you need more help for building a winder stairway, I have created a book that will make your job a lot easier, providing you with step-by-step -step instructions. So make sure you check that book out, and that book can be found at our website or even on some of the most popular book selling websites throughout the entire universe, or at the very least, in your country.